but with models, they can make great decisions one day and the next day they turn rotten, like, like bananas. Bananas. Yeah, okay, so you're saying that the data scientists who build the models should be responsible for operating them in production. Oh, uh, us? Oh, no, 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 no. We create models, no, we don't operate them. You pay us to build the race cars, not manage the racetrack. <laughs> not happening, not happening. Well, if it's not the data scientist, then who? Zip is right, Lou. You know, these AI models, very different kind of beast. And they're really valuable. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Worth millions. So then, Ira, maybe this is your baby, yes? I mean, you run our global infrastructure, right? Well, yeah, sure. But, you know, the business units, they're really the ones driving the AI stuff. You know that. Awana, did you uh, want to uh, weigh in here? No, no, I mean, yes. I mean, there's a lot of risk with these AI models. We've got government regulations, internal compliance, fairness, transparency. We have financial risks, regulatory risks, reputational risks. Okay, fine then. You're responsible for corporate risk, so I'm assuming you're on top of this. So far, yeah. But these AI models are more complex than the stuff we've been used to dealing with. And there's more and more of them, coming at us faster and faster. They're multiplying like rabbits. Rabbits and bananas. 